Now, in this short lecture, we'll talk about uh, characters in the great poem, The Night in the Panther Skin. Uh, the brave and loyal knights of Tandil and Tariel, these two characters represent the most devoted friends and tender lovers, both heroes capable of uh, courtly love. Courtly love is a love that emphasizes uh, nobility and uh, chivalry and uh, men endowed with uh, free will, that is to say, uh, of Tandil and Tariel. They initially were actively involved and served the kingdoms, held the uh, position of modern steward or mayor of the palace. Besides their position, they only obey their pillars, that is to say, Tinantin and the standard region. Therefore, their love and dedication is unwavering. The mutual commit uh, commitment and friendship they swear also extend to a third person, Nuradin Pridon, that is the ruler of the city of Mugazanzar, who is also endowed with the same heroic qualities. Tariel is, however, distinguished by his wild character, as symbolized by his wearing the panther skin. The qualities associated with, ca with the cat is dedication and courage. His hatred and violence could be extreme and uncontrollable. It is also close to St. George slaying the dragon, whose cult was particularly strong in the 12th century, especially in the episode where Tariel kills a lion and a panther. In the next step, I will talk about the faithful and patient lovers in the at the standard jam. Although they take little action, the female characters, Tinatin and the Standard and John, are constantly present in thoughts of the knights, of the military, of course, and serve to give the narrative tension as a whole. Princesses higher in social rank then their servant knights are inspired by Queen Tamar, that was the king of Georgia, or reflect the fact that each of them is sovereign in their own realm. That is to say, Tinatin uh, is the sovereign of uh, uh, Kingdom of Arabia and the standard gun is the sovereign of uh, Kingdom of India. Tinatin chooses her own husband, which references Queen Tamar, who also chose her second husband. Uh, as a role as sovereign. So, what you mentioned uh, before, uh, that is the sovereign of Kingdom of Arabia. And her father, Osteban, ceding his throne to his daughter, Tinatin. Uh, it uh, is references uh, King George III of Georgia, who was succeeded by his daughter in 1178, after his death. Tinatin is a static character who leaves no time to the court of her father in Arabia. The star, she is a prisoner in distant regions, that is to say, the country of the Kanjis, 
of this country. Uh, she is also passive. But uh, their confidence, righteousness, shows these two women being faithful and respective lovers. As for Patman, she is an altered representation of their type, that is to say, the type of uh, Tina Tina and Nestanda and John, but an adulteress during the absence of her husband. During the absence of her husband, Hussein, she betrayed her husband by falling in love and making love with uh, uh, Tandil. Patman takes little account of family honor as she betrayed her husband, Hussein, and as she humiliates him on account of his bodily defects. Her character is true to life from the artistic point of view. Despite everything, she is capable of displaying both affection and sincere warmth, peculiar to a woman. She spares no effort to serve Nestan. It is uh, very characteristic that when Patman learns of the purpose of, of Tandil's journey, the purpose of, of Tandil's journey was to find the abducted standard gun. So she makes no attempt to keep the man she loves, that is to, uh, to say, of Tandil, at her place even for a short time. Okay, thank you very much.